Hi, I'm Maria, and this is my daughter, Ada. And today uh, we will prepare a Finnish traditional uh, food, which is called macaroni casserole, and it's uh, uh, loved by kids and adults too. Hope you enjoy. So Ada is starting to uh, by spreading the carrots first. And while she's doing that, I'm chopping it on. I'm gonna put in the bowl. Once we have shredded the carrots and I chop the onions, we have to fry, it, fry them in the pan. Okay, so next step is to caramelize the onions. So I'm gonna pour some uh, olive oil in the pan. And add the onions here. And while the onions are getting caramelized, the water is boiling for the macaronis. So we add a little bit of salt in the boiling water. We have two cups of macaroni. And they will take like five minutes to boil. And yeah, in Finland, uh, all the uh, students or all the kids usually start to cook once they are in the eighth grade. They take cooking classes at school, and uh, it's usually like every second week they have three hours of uh, cooking, and then they are divided into small groups where one of the groups makes the appetizers and the second group makes the main dish and then the third group makes the dessert. So that's a very great way to learn how to do a very healthy food. Adding a little bit of salt here. I already set the oven to 375 so it's preheating the oven. And now these are ready so I'm gonna pour them here. I will add now, I will try the beef. And I will actually you can stir a little bit of the macaroni as well. I'm The so then we add the beef bouillon. But you can also use salt and pepper, maybe paprika. Very basic. And whatever you want to spice it with, yeah, you can use your creativity. And I learned how to cook from actually also at school, but also from my mom. And uh, this dish was taught to my mom from her mom. And it was usually eaten by when uh, the villages had big parties, and this was one of the main dishes there. But also, they had some other casseroles made out of the uh, rutabaga or carrots or potatoes and then we add some pepper here <laughs> just to spice it a little bit more so now I need to grease the pan where I'm putting the dish and I just add everything here Then the 
carrots and onions. Okay, so I just strained the macaroni. I'm gonna add it here. Before I put it in the oven, I'm still doing something uh, to make it more moist that it doesn't dry in the oven. The carrot is not the original ingredient, but I add it because it gives some more sweetness to the dish, like the sweet onion as well, and uh, I think it gives more flavor to the whole dish. And then we make the final touch. We have milk, I use lactate milk, and then we add some <laughs> egg. You can use one egg or two eggs, whatever you prefer, but I usually want it more moist. So less egg, it kind of keeps more moist. And then we add some uh, pepper and salt. Again, if you want to spice this with other spices, that's fine too, so you can be creative. And then we just pour the whole thing on top of it. Butter just to get the crispier top once it's in the oven. And this takes about 35 to 45 minutes to cook in the oven. So now this is ready, it goes in the oven. So once the dish is in the oven, I'm going to finish a little bit as a side dish. So I'm cutting some tomatoes. And then I'm adding some fresh basil. Okay, I think, yeah, it looks great. It's ready. It smells good. Let's take it out. It's ready to be served. So, uh, actually, it could cool down a little bit, but I'm gonna put it on the plate and then it cools a little bit there. So, I'm gonna use. Uh, Okay, the dinner is ready to be served. It looks great. It smells good, right? And uh, now we are ready to serve it. In Finnish we say, Hyvää ruokahalua, which is bon appetit. Enjoy your meal.